blood. I release the blood. Cavalry blood coming down upon you. Infinite, more powerful. Viewers all around the world, you're welcome to Roadmap to Jesus International Ministry in Jesus' name. People of God, once again, I want to tell you wonderful, happy, and glorious new week. Jesus Christ has given you and I another opportunity to see this wonderful day. Today is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Thank you very much for tuning in today. There is a blessing for you this morning. There is a blessing from above for you this morning. Are you prepared to receive your blessing this morning? Are you prepared to receive what God Almighty has bestowed upon today? It is a day that the Lord has made. You will rejoice and be glad in it. Yes. Today is a day not to complain. Today is a day not to lament. Today is a day not to cry. It is a day that the Lord has made for you to rejoice and be glad. So there is something about gladness and being joyful. That is when you realize that God made that day especially because of you. People of God, when you know that the day is made for your own good, you will not complain, lament. Rather, you will take advantage of it. People of God, get ready. Because any moment from now, you will be touched by God Almighty. There is a strong force here this morning. Yeah, a strong force that is about to change someone's situation from failure to success. There is a great force from above that will change someone's family from lack, complain, to blessings. There is a strange and strong force from above. That will change your situation from your past to where God wants you to be. People of God, don't miss out. Be in spirit. Jesus Christ is on his way to attend to you right now. Be in spirit. Don't be carnal. Be sensitive to the move of God. If you are not sensitive, you can't sense God's presence. If you are not sensitive, you cannot receive anything from God. It takes only serious-minded people. It takes only spiritual-minded people. It takes only those who are sensitive, who are spiritually alert in their mind, to be able to discern when God is present. And when God is present, know that healing is just like breathing. When God is present, sickness can no longer stand. When God is present, all your complaints, setback, and limitation for years will come to an end instantly. People of God, Prepare your heart. Jesus Christ is about to touch you this morning. Jesus Christ does not select who to bless. He does not select who to heal. He does not select who to deliver. Whether you are, your sins are great or small, Jesus Christ can forgive them all. Whether your own stagnation is huge, caused by you or Satan, Jesus Christ can deliver you. All he needs from you is for you to be willing. Once you are willing, once you are sensitive, once you are spiritually alert, once you are prepared, Jesus Christ will attend to you. God bless you as you prepare your heart this morning in Jesus' name. Join me as we make this declaration. Lord Jesus, 
open my eyes that I may see wonderful things. Say, Lord Jesus, open my eyes to see wonderful things. Open my eyes to see the promises of God for my life. Open my eyes to see what I am destined to be. Open my eye, open my eyes, open my eyes that I may behold wonderful things. Open my eyes, O oh Lord, to see my destination. Open my eyes to possess my possession. Open my eyes to receive my portion in the kingdom of God. Open my eyes, O oh Lord, that I may receive what you have destined for me. Right now, make that confession. Say, Lord, open my eyes. Open my eyes to receive from you. Open my eyes to possess my possession. Open my eyes to receive my breakthrough. Open my eyes to receive my favor. Open my eyes to receive my deliverance. Open my eyes. Yes, make this confession right now. This is a revelation. This is a revelation. Your eyes must be open. Many of you are looking at me and saying, Man of God, but my eyes are open. There is a eyes and there are seen eyes. You may have eyes and not have a seen eyes. Let that eye that sees be open in the name of Jesus Christ. Your spiritual insight, spiritual illumination be open in the name of Jesus Christ. I open you to deeper revelation, deeper encounter, deeper mysteries in the kingdom of God. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command your spiritual eyes to be open. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. This morning I'm here to pray with you. And to declare with you. This is a prophetic Monday. Prepare your heart. Because your life is going to shift to another level. Your mindset will be corrected. Everything that has been causing fear will be removed. This morning. Ask God to open your eyes to see healing. Open my eyes to see my deliverance. Open my eyes to see my promotion. Open my eyes, O oh Lord, to see my breakthrough. Open my eyes, O oh Lord, to see my children. Open my eyes to see my husband. Open my eyes to see my wife. Open my eyes to see a wonderful family. Open my eyes to see a great future. Open your eyes, open your eyes, open your eyes. Say, Lord Jesus, open my eyes. Open my eyes to see a great future. Open my eyes to see a great family. Open my eyes to see a great leader that you have destined me to be. Open my eyes, oh Lord. Open my eyes, oh Lord. Open my eyes, oh Lord. I command our eyes to be open. 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 Eyes that see beyond. Eyes that see beyond. Eyes that see beyond present situation. I say be open in the name of Jesus Christ. Be open in the name of Jesus Christ. Be open in the name of Jesus Christ. Eyes from above. That sees beyond limitation. That sees beyond stagnation. That sees beyond poverty. I say that eyes be open in the name of Jesus Christ. 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 In Jesus mighty name we pray. Amen. People of God be sensitive. Jesus Christ will touch everyone. I see everyone being touched. Let me tell you I see it. I see it. My eyes can see your deliverance. My eyes can see your healing. My eyes can see your restoration. My eyes can see your breakthrough. I say, I see that breakthrough coming to you. I see that healing coming to you. I see that deliverance. I'm not just telling you. I see you being delivered. I see you being set free. Today, I am seeing your breakthrough already. I am seeing promotion for you already. You, I say, I see your document being approved. In the name of Jesus Christ. Pay attention this morning. And God Almighty will bless you. In Jesus name. Amen. And amen. People of God. Before we pray. We are coming back. Today is a day for you to receive. Prepare your heart. This is a divine day. And we are going to receive. In Jesus name. People of God. We want to talk about. A seen eyes. We need to know that there are two kind of eyes. You have your physical eyes and we have a seen eyes. That is the spiritual eyes. Oftentimes people can see physically. But you don't know that there is another eyes. 
that sees. This your eye is the light of your body. Your eyes, if truly open, people of God, is the light of your body. Remember the case of Elisha and the servant. When Elisha and the servants were surrounded by soldiers and army all around, and they were only two. He ran after seeing the whole thing, the whole army surrounding them. He ran to the master. I said, Master, we are in trouble. I see soldiers, chariots everywhere, horses everywhere. And the master said, let me tell you, what you are using to see is your physical eye. Your physical eye can only see trouble. Your physical eye can only see challenges. But you need the other eyes. He lay hand on him and say, let me strengthen your faith. Then you see the host of heaven surrounding you. People of God, if you only see with your physical eyes alone, you cannot see enough. If you only see with your physical eye, you cannot stop complaining. If you only see with your physical eye, you cannot stop lamenting. If you only see with your physical eye, you will see frustration, depression, lamentation, and everything. But when you log in to the spiritual eyes, there you begin to see God's glory upon your life. There you begin to see God's victory upon your life. There you begin to see God's greatness upon your life. Our eyes is not only for seeing physical things, but for spiritual things. There is mystery behind this, our eyes. That whatever you can see, you can receive. Anything you cannot see, you cannot receive. What are you seeing, viewers? Anything you cannot see, you cannot receive. There is a relationship between your eyes and your destiny. If you can see them, you can possess them. God will never give to you what you cannot see. God will never make available for you what you cannot see. The level to which you can see is the level to which you can possess. The level at which you can see is the same level to which you can receive from God. What are you seeing, people of God? If you see fear, you only live in the realm of fear. If you keep seeing sickness, you will continue to be sick. If you see pain, you will always be in pain. If you see depression, you will never leave the realm of depression. What can you see, people of God? What can you see? What can you see? If you want a greater thing, you need to see a greater thing. If you want healing, you need to start seeing healing, even in the midst of pain. Let me tell you, Paul and Silas were in the prison. They were flogged and chained. But what they were seeing was a different thing. They were seeing the glory and the presence of God. They were seeing freedom. But since they could see the freedom, nothing can hold it. Whatever you can see cannot be stopped. Anything you can see cannot be stopped. Permit me to ask you, what do you see? Your life cannot be greater than what you see. Your life cannot be greater than what you see. Your future is at the mercy of your sight. Your destiny is at the mercy of your sight. Jesus saw the glory. That is why he was able to endure the suffering. Jesus see physically, spiritually, the glory. That is why he was able to endure the hardship. Joseph saw the glory. That is why he was able to endure the dry pit, slavery, and the prison. What do you see? What do you see, people of God? Join me as we check our proof test. Turn with me to the book of Genesis chapter 13 and verse 14. Genesis chapter 13 and verse 14. I read, And the Lord said to Abraham, After Lot has separated from him, People of God, sometimes, before you can see, Sometimes before you can have a deeper revelation, you need to separate from friends. You need to separate from distraction. You need to separate from a lot of things that are calling for your attention. He said, after Abraham has departed from Lot. 
Now what happened? Lift up your eyes now and look from the place where you are. This is God speaking, talking to Abraham. He said, Abraham, lift up your eyes. I'm telling you from wherever you are watching me from right now, lift up your eyes from where you are. The same thing that God said to Abraham is good for you. Lift up your eyes from where you are. Northward, southward, east, eastward, and westward. For all the land which you see, I will give to you and your descender forever. I take it again. Verse 15. For all the land which you see, I will give to you and your descender forever. For as far as you can see, he said, I will give you forever. God cannot give you what you cannot see. He said, Abraham, if you can lift up your eyes, if you can see the miracle, if you can see the healing, if you can see yourself being delivered, let me tell you, the woman with the issue of blood, say, if I can just see Jesus, if I can just touch Jesus, he has seen herself being healed already. She has seen herself being delivered already. She has seen herself being saved already. Can you see yourself? Can you see your future? Can you see your breakthrough? I don't know the mess you are in this morning. I don't know the hardship that is around you this morning. That bills is too much. That uh, house rent and everything. Marriage pressure here and there. Disappointment and everything around you. Let me tell you, even in the midst of that challenges, even in the midst of that situation, if you can see, God will make it happen for you. If you can just see yourself at the top, you will get there. If you can just see yourself walking in victory, you will get there. What are you seeing this morning? What can you see? Are you still seeing depth all around you? No. Are you still seeing yourself being sick? You that are on the sick bed. What are you seeing? Are you seeing yourself being sick? No! My body can be sick, but my vision is not sick. Well, whatever you can see, your body will soon be carried there. Anything you can see, you can achieve. Anything you can see, you can possess. Turn with me to 2 Kings chapter 2 and verse 10. You that you are looking for a greater portion of anointing, you are looking for restoration. You are looking for promotion. Read this. This is an encouragement for you. Look at what God said to Abraham. If you want prosperity, if you want breakthrough, if you want restoration, study that book of Genesis chapter 13, verse 14. Now, you want anointing? You want a greater portion? Your ministry, you want him to move further? Let me see you. Let me tell you. Read the book of 2 Kings chapter 2 and verse 10. Now this is an encounter between Elisha and Elijah. Elisha is asking for a double portion of the anointing now. Yes, it's asking for a double portion. If you just take that 2 Kings chapter 2, take it downward, you will see that encounter. Okay, let me take it from verse 9 for you for more clarity. And so it was when they have crossed over, that Elijah said to Elisha, Ask, what may I do for you before I am taken away from you? Elisha said, Please, let a double portion of your spirit fall upon me. Verse 10. So Elijah said, You have asked for a hard thing. Are you seeing it now? Elisha sees something too big for himself. But whatever you can see, you can possess it. Elijah has to tell him that what you ask for is very, very difficult. But nevertheless, nevertheless, I'm telling you, your situation may look horrible, but nevertheless. Your challenges may look horrible, but nevertheless. Your situation, your family may be confusing right now, nevertheless. Nobody to train you, no helper, no, no destiny friends. Let me tell you, nevertheless, if you can see yourself being there, you will get there. Nevertheless, that you are sick now. Nevertheless, that there is no money in your pocket now. Nevertheless, that you don't have car now. Nevertheless, that you are not 
you, you don't have a job now. Nevertheless, can you see yourself walking? Can you see yourself driving car? Can you see whatever you can see, you can receive. Yes. I take it again, verse 10. So he said, you have asked for a hard thing, but nevertheless, if you see me when I am taken away from you, it shall be so for you. But if not, it shall not be so. People of God, do you hear what he said? He said, if you can see. <laughs> Somebody is about to see this morning. He said, if you can see, you will see this morning. If you can see me at the end, you will possess a double portion. If you can see your miracle, so shall it be for you. If you can see that job given to you, so shall it be for you. If you can see your children, if you can see that children you have been looking for, barrenness for 10 years, and you are seeing children, babies, twins, coming to you, it shall be unto you like that. What are you seeing this morning, people of God? Wake up from that slumber. Wake up from that doubt. Wake up from that fear. Wake up from that unbelief. And begin to see great destiny. And begin to see a great future. And begin to see promotion. And begin to see customer coming to your shop. And begin to see lifting. And begin to see favor upon your life. What can you see, people of God? What are you seeing right now? What are you seeing right now? What are you seeing right now? Whatever you can see, receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever you can see, receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever you can see, receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Nothing can stop what you are seeing. All you need is a seen eye. Right now, people of God, I know that your faith has been lifted up. And your doubt has been shrink away. Right now it is time. Wherever you are watching us from, this is Roadmap to Jesus International Ministry. And my name is Custom Ada. This week is not a week of fear. It's not a week of doubt. It's not a week of unbelief. I don't know how long you have been in that situation. Now see testimony coming. I don't know how long you have been in that challenges. Right now it is time. See victory coming your way. You have been knocked down many times. See victory coming your way. See victory coming your way. Right now, I command everything that surrounds you. Every fear and unbelief that surrounds you. Doubt that surrounds you. Doubt that surrounds you. Failure that surrounds you. Hardship that surrounds you. To give way in the name of Jesus Christ. I say give way in the name of Jesus Christ. I say give way in the name of Jesus Christ. I say give way. Give way. Give way. Right now, begin to see your destiny. Begin to see your future. Begin to see your dream. Begin to see your revelation. Begin to see, see, see your promotion. Begin to see them right now. Say, I can see my future. I can see my blessing. I see customer coming my way. I see breakthrough coming my way. I see restoration coming my way. I see peace of mind coming my way. I see great family. I see a great home, a great marriage, a great future in my life. Begin to see them, see them, see them, see them. This is a new week. Whatever you see this new week, you shall possess it. Whatever you can see this new week, you can, you can receive it. Anything you can see today, you are going to possess it. I see a great home. I see a great marriage. I see a great family. I see a great ministry. 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 Begin to see them. Begin to see them. I cannot see failure. I cannot see defeat. I cannot see failure. I cannot see defeat. I cannot see hardship. I can't see sickness. I'm seeing good health. I cannot see sickness. I see good health. I cannot see poverty. I see blessing. I cannot see. I cannot see barrenness. I see fruitfulness. Begin to see. 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 I see my children doing well. I see my children succeeding. I see my family succeeding. I see my husband being promoted. I see my wife being promoted. I see my family being promoted. I see my family being lifted up. I can see. I can see. I can see. I can see. Whatever you can see right now, begin to possess them. Begin to possess them. Begin to possess them. I can see a great future for myself. I see a great future for myself. I walk and move in that destiny. Yes, I can see. I can see. What are you seeing? 
What are you seeing? What are you seeing? What are you seeing? Receive what you are seeing right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive what you are seeing right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I cannot see nightmare. I cannot see evil attacks. I cannot see nightmare. I cannot see evil attacks. No, 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 no. I can't see evil attacks. I cannot see nightmare. I see dreams, revelations, prophetic dreams, revelation, revelation, divine direction, divine inspiration. That is what I say. I say I can see you being delivered. I can see you being delivered. I can see you being set free. I can see you being lifted higher. I can see you be free. Be free. Be free. I see you being delivered. Wherever you are right now, anywhere you are right now, be delivered. I see you being delivered already. I see you being set free already. I see you being delivered already. I see you being set free already. I see you being delivered already. I see you being set free already. I say be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Right now, begin to be delivered. Be delivered. Say, I see deliverance for myself. I see deliverance for my business. I see deliverance for my home. Deliverance for my family. Deliverance for my family. Deliver for my family. I see this family being delivered. I see this home being set free. I see this home being set free. In the name of Jesus Christ. All spirit that blind your sight. Spiritual blindness. Spiritual blindness. Spiritual blindness. Spiritual blindness. Spiritual deafness. Spiritual blindness. Spiritual dumbness. Holy Ghost. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire. Fire. Every spirit that block your spiritual inside. Your spiritual illumination. Every spirit that blocks it. I send fire to those spirits right now. Holy Ghost. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire. Fire. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. I command your spiritual eyes to be open. Your physical eyes to be open. Your spiritual eyes to be open. Holy Ghost. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire. 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 Fire the name of Jesus Christ. I command you to receive your deliverance. 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 Every stagnation, destiny that has been tied down for long, destiny that is dim, that destiny that has not brightened up, that your destiny that is still opaque, that is blunt, blurry, you can't see the vision very well. Every unclear vision, right now I command you to be clear. Be clear. Let there be clarity in your dream. Clarity in your vision. Clarity in your dream. Clarity in your vision. Clarity in that direction. Clarity. 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 Holy Ghost. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire. 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 Fire the name of Jesus Christ. I command every force of darkness, every force of darkness, every force of darkness, every force of darkness coming together to hold you down. Holy Ghost, fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire, 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 fire. Right now, anyone in darkness, anyone in darkness, when you are in darkness, you cannot see. When you are in darkness, you cannot see. When you are in darkness, you cannot see. Right now, come out of the darkness. Your career come out of darkness. Your business come out of darkness. Your home come out of darkness. Holy Ghost, fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire, fire, fire. Distance is not a barrier. Whichever country you are watching me from, either from Australia, Uganda, USA, UK, wherever you are watching us from, from Cameroon, from Ghana, from wherever you are watching us from, Botswana, Zambia, Lesotho, South Africa, Sweden or Switzerland, anywhere you are watching us from, from Italy, Jamaica, Brazil, Belgium, right now I command the light of God to shine. That darkness in that country, darkness in your home, darkness in your community, darkness in your community, darkness in your compound, darkness in the village, anywhere there's darkness that is holding you down. I say let there be light. 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 Let there be light. Let there be light. Holy Ghost. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire. 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 Fire the name of Jesus Christ. I command the light of God to shine. I command the light of God to shine. 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 The Bible says in John 1 verse 5, it says the light shines in darkness. The light shines in darkness. Your light will shine in the darkness. Your light begin to shine. Begin to shine upon every darkness. Your light from God begin to shine. As they begin to shine, come out of the darkness. 
Come out of the darkness. Every hidden darkness. Hidden darkness. In your business, in your career, in your relationship with God. Hidden darkness. Hidden darkness. I command them out. I say I command them out. I command them out. I command them out. Holy Ghost, fire them. Never just Christ. Fire. 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 I'm seeing a family right now being loose from that chain of darkness. This is a generational darkness. This is a family darkness. Every family member has been tied down. You from Zambia, right now be set free. Holy Ghost, fire them. Never just Christ. Fire. 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 Fire them, never just Christ. I see you coming out from darkness. I say, I see you coming out from darkness. I see you coming out from darkness. I see you coming out from darkness. I see you coming out from sickness. I see you coming out from fibroid. I see you coming out from pain. I see you coming out from bleeding. Bleeding is darkness. Hardship, sickness is darkness. Demon possess is darkness. I command that darkness to come out. I command that darkness to come out. I command that darkness to come out. Holy Ghost, fire, fire, fire. Fire! Fire! Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Let there be light in your life. Let there be light. I say let there be light. 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 Every hidden demon. Hidden demon. Demon that have been in your life for so long that keep hiding for, for deliverance. They are demons. They don't manifest. Anytime that there is breakthrough, they come and snatch your breakthrough. Every demon waiting for you at the point of breakthrough. Every demon waiting for you at the point of breakthrough. Every demon that waits, anytime you want to make profit in your business, that is when they come and strike. Right now, you that demon, you that demon that waits for people at the point of their destiny, at the point of their breakthrough, at the point of their success. You demon that is destined to snatch people. You devourer, spirit of devourer, spirit of devourer, Holy Ghost, fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Fire, 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 the name of Jesus Christ. That spirit of devourer, that spirit of devourer, that spirit of devourer, that spirit of devourer. Anywhere you are right now, I send fire to you. That send fire to you. You cannot hide. You cannot hide. That spirit that keep eating from their finances, eating from their finances, eating from their promotion. Many people are supposed to be promoted since for now, but Satan is eating it. Eating it up. At the point of promotion, something will happen. At the point of then to approve your letter, something will happen. Right now, whatever that is stopping your promotion, whatever that is stopping your transfer, Holy Ghost, fire them. Name of Jesus Christ. Fire. If you can see yourself promoted, nothing can stop it. If you can see yourself being transferred, nothing can stop it. I send fire to every power that wants to stop you. Every demon that wants to stop you. Every demon that wants to stop you. Every demon that wants to stop you. Holy Ghost. Fire, 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 fire the name of Jesus Christ. All demons that want to stop you. All demons that want to stop you. All demons that want to stop you. Holy Ghost, fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire, 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 fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire every unclean spirit living inside of anyone. Every unclean spirit living inside of anyone, marine spirit, water spirit, any kind of spirit, spiritual husband, spiritual wife, idols in the family, whatever spirit that is living inside of you, I say come out right now. Holy Ghost, fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire, spirit of snakes, python or scorpion, every kind of moving object moving in your body. Right now I send fire to that, those spirits. Those spirits that keep moving your womb, moving your body, moving. Every moving object in your body, I send fire down to them. Holy Ghost, fire, 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 fire them. Never just Christ. Can you see your healing? Can you see your deliverance, people of God? What are you seeing right now? Are you still seeing failure? Are you still seeing setback? Are you still seeing bad luck? Are you seeing your healing right now? Are you seeing your healing right now? Right now, anybody that is sick, Place your hand, place your hand, place your hand, place your hand. Place your hand there, place your hand there. Place your hand there, place your hand there. Every sickness and attack. Every attack. Every attack. I say come out right now. Holy Ghost. Fire them. Never just Christ. Fibro, cancer, ulcer. Bleeding of any kind. Hormonia imbalance. Hormonia imbalance. Fibroid. Ovariances. 
Hovedances, hovedances, inflammatory disease of any kind, multiple fibroid, that barrenness, staphylococcus, staphylococcus, diabetes, diabetes, blood pressure, blood pressure, blood pressure, blood pressure, kidney failure, kidney problem, kidney problem, liver problem, prostate problem, prostate cancer, prostate cancer, prostate ulcer, whatever it may be right now, I suffer to it. Difficulty in walking, difficulty in breathing, difficulty in seeing, poor vision, poor vision, glaucoma, 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 cataract in the eyes. Right now, I command them to come out. Migraine headache, migraine headache, chest pain, waist pain, back pain, any kind of pain in your body right now. I command all of them to come out. Holy Ghost, fire, fire the name of Jesus Christ, fire, fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Fire. 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 Fire the name of Jesus Christ. Come out of them right now. I say come out of them right now. I say come out of them right now. I say come out of them right now. 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 I say come out. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Let there be healing your bone. Let there be healing your blood. Whatever you have eaten from the table of enemy. Any kind of poisonous substance in your body. 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 I say come out now. That poison. That poison. That poison. That poison. Holy Ghost. Fire them. Never just cry. Fire. Fire them. Never just cry. Fire. Fire. Fire them. Never just cry. I command you to be set free. I command you to be set free. I command you to be delivered. I command you to be set free. Right now be set free. I say be set free. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Receive your total freedom. Your total freedom. Your total freedom. Your total freedom. Headache is gone. My great headache is gone. Difficulty in hearing. Pain in your ear. I say it's gone. In the name of Jesus Christ. Conversion. Epileptic spirit. I say all of them are cast out. In the name of Jesus Christ. I see you being healed. Are you seeing yourself being healed? I see you being delivered. Are you delivered? I see you being set free. Are you set free? I see you being healed. Are you healed? I see you being saved. Are you saved? Be saved in the name of Jesus Christ. Be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Be delivered in the name of Jesus Christ. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be delivered. Be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. This week is a testimony week for you. 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 All your debt is cancelled this week. All your debt is cancelled this week. All your debt is cancelled this week. In the name of Jesus Christ, step into a new level of of breakthrough. Step into a new level of healing. Step into a new level of favor. A new level of breakthrough. A new level of favor. A new level of breakthrough. A new level of breakthrough. A new level of breakthrough. A new level of promotion. Step into that level. Step into that level right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. People of God, Jesus Christ has done it again. Jesus Christ has done it again. Nothing can stop God's blessings for your life. God bless you. Remain blessed in Jesus' name. People of God, thank you for joining us. If you are watching, you are watching the Roadmap to Jesus International Ministry. And my name is Gustav Ada. People of God, make sure you comment. Make sure you subscribe. Many of you have not subscribed. You are only watching. Subscribe so that you can be seeing us all the time, anytime we are live. Subscribe and turn on your notification. Make sure you share, like, and share it with everyone. Comment. Some of you don't comment, you only watch. Make sure you comment. God Almighty will bless you as you continue to promote the gospel in the name of Jesus Christ. How many souls will you save with this message this morning? How many souls, how many lives are you going to change with this message this morning? Make sure you share it with your family and friends. May God Almighty bless you as you continue to evangelize. Post it to different platforms. Post it on status, post it on social media platform. It is not only funny things or things that are circular you post. Post godly things. Let your status be known for godly things. Let your social media, let your Facebook, your Twitter and everything be known for the gospel. 
it is good. You cannot be ashamed of the gospel. Never. If you are ashamed of the gospel, if you are ashamed to tell men about Jesus, on the last day, he also will be ashamed to tell God about you. So people of God, let us promote the kingdom of God and promote the work of God. May God bless you in Jesus' name. Those of you that want to be part of one-on-one -on -one sections, every day we have one-on-one -on -one section of prayer. Deliverance starts from 8 to evening. Make sure you call the prayer line number that is displayed on the screen. The first prayer line number is on WhatsApp. The other one is on the direct line. You can choose whichever one you call. Either you call on WhatsApp. It's preferable you call on WhatsApp. Call the first prayer line number this morning and we will pray for you and we'll be positioned for the deliverance section. It is very, very important. Everyone needs deliverance. Everyone. Everyone. Don't say it's ordinary. I you know the, the country is hard. That is why I'm sick because of the weather. No, if you continue to entertain sickness, sickness will never leave you. If you continue to entertain pain, pain will never leave you. If you continue to accommodate fear, fear will never leave you. People of God, you need deliverance. Everyone needs deliverance. Call the prayer line numbers today with, with faith in your heart. You will be delivered and you will testify like others. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you as you call in the name of Jesus. And also we want to use this opportunity to appreciate all our supporters for making it possible for us to be live every morning. Let me tell you, Jesus Christ is watching you. Jesus Christ is watching your consistency. Jesus Christ is watching your faithfulness. Jesus Christ is watching a heart that you have for God. For you to always see that the ministry is moving on. The ministry is being taken care of. The ministry has what it takes to come at life. People of God, may God continue to bless you. All our supporters, all our partners, may you continue to grow in strength and graces. And you know that our duty and our covenant and relationship with God is to make sure we always pray for you as partners and supporters. There is nothing that you are doing that is not in our control or on God's control here. We are always praying for you. You must know that someone is praying for you. And that is a great benefit. Jesus Christ will not allow anything to happen to you because you are precious in his kingdom. You are making sure that the kingdom is moving. God bless you so much. Those of us that are yet to be a partner, People of God, let everyone come together and become a partner. We cannot do it alone. We need you. Just the same way you need us. We need one another. Jesus Christ, make this ministry to be here so that you can partner with us and we can be your prayer partner. We are doing our own diligently to make sure we reach out to you. You too, you have to play your own role to make sure you support and be a partner. You are not doing it for the ministry. You are doing it for God. It is an assignment from God. It is your way of serving God. Becoming a partner. This is not a ministry that asks you to pay this or that. No. But let it come to your heart that you know that the ministry, for it to continue, need to be supported. For the ministry to further on, need to be supported. So everyone should know this. The grace of God is free. We don't receive money for anything here. The anointing, the healing is free. But the means to take it Vira is not free. Technology is not free. Power is not free. That is electricity. It's not free. People of God, you pay for net. You pay for network. You pay for everything here. And it takes a lot. We are always live in the morning, afternoon, in the night. And it takes resources. It takes electricity. It takes the networking and everything. People of God, let us come together and make sure that we join hands and don't just leave the body for one person. Please, may God Almighty touch your heart to become a partner today in the name of Jesus Christ. If you are a partner, be a consistent partner in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, how do you become a partner? If you want to be a partner, you can just log into our website www.roadmaptojesus.org slash give. That is if you have a MasterCard, a credit card, a debit card or any card that can enable you to do an online payment. You can just go to our website, www.roadmaptojesus.org slash give. Slash give. Then go to the donation section and use your card to make your payment. And after you make your payment, you screenshot it. And you send that copy to us so that it will be registered on your name. We keep documents here. We keep all records of partners here. May God bless you as you do that. 
But if you cannot do an online payment, it's not a problem. You can still call the prayer line numbers. We will give you the church account details that you can use through your phone or through the bank. We will give you the church account details that you can use to transfer. If you know that you cannot do uh, an online payment, you call us and we will give you the church official account details and you will be able to make your payment and you send the receipt to us. Also, if you know that one too may not be possible by you, you have also a medium in your country through Western Union, World Remit, or MoneyGram, or RIA, or any mobile money that you want to use to send. You can simply call us and we will send you the information that you can use to do those platforms. May God bless you as you take that decision today. I see your heart being touched in the name of Jesus Christ. Let us work together. Together we can save more souls. Together we can heal the sick. Together we can stop Satan from touching and destroying people's lives. God bless you as you join this mission of saving life, saving nations, and saving the world. God bless you. Right now, before we go, those of you that want to call for prayer, prepare yourself right now. Start preparing yourself. We are moving to the deliverance section anywhere from now. Before we go, let us make this declaration. Wherever you are all around the world, people of God, join us to make this declaration. You are loved by God. Tell yourself, I am loved by God. I and my household are loved by God. My business, my career, my home, my family, my future is loved by God. You, despite this challenges around you. I am here to tell you, despite the hardship, the pain, I say you are loved by God. God bless you.